If you were early in the morning and watch the sunrise on the lake, even if none's in your bucket, the beer scenery will fill the space. When the barber goes down with tugging, this thrill compares to nothing. Yeah, this that life for loving, cause you're dealing with some fishermen. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Professor Slabs here, and you just tuned into another episode of Slab Life Fishing. Well, y'all see my, uh, what the weather like this morning, ladies and gentlemen. Windy, windy day, okay? So I wasn't gonna bring the barbers out today, as you guys can see, I got them three-eighths of an ounce. Weights again, I'm out here bottom rigging. Got a new guy, got a matter of fact, I got the whole crew again. Ladies and gentlemen, same crew from last video, okay? Back out here to the old dock, ladies and gentlemen. See if I can get out here and catch a few shell cracker bluegill on the bottom on a windy day. Okay, so what I want you guys to do is stay tuned, and I want you guys to be patient with Professor this morning. Now, I ain't got no camera woman. I ain't got Mama Slides with me. My baby at home today. I ain't got CJ. My boy had a little extra tutoring class he wanted to go to today to get him ready for his big test. And y'all know Jeremiah. I tried to wake him up. He looked up at me and like. Ugh. So he was still asleep, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm out here by myself. I got me a little prop behind me. I'm gonna try propping it and getting y'all the video, man. So what I want you guys to do is stay tuned and get ready for some bit over rods, ladies and gentlemen, because it's getting ready to happen. And you best believe that we finna try to catch some on a windy day, man. So y'all stay tuned. Blue Gill and Shell Cracker fishing on a windy day. Slap like baby. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get baited up and cast out. Red worms. And ladies and gentlemen, I can't call his name out by heart right now, but the person that named this pole, Frankenslab. That's the winner, ladies and gentlemen, that's the name. I'm going with Frankenslab instead of Frankenstein or Frankenslab. Get old Franken slab, throw it out first. I don't think I'm fishing with everybody today because it's very windy. Franken slab out there in the spot. let nothing stop me ladies and gentlemen rain sleet wind you don't matter to me when I got the itch to go fishing ladies and gentlemen I'm gonna scratch it y'all put in the comment section if y'all the same way if y'all don't mind a little wind a little rain I'm gonna try to work it out the best we can for all my people that do not know this is how I rig my worm ladies and gentlemen See him squirming and still wiggling around, but that's bluegill caviar. Bite, ladies and gentlemen. I got him. Get that fast, ladies and gentlemen.
Feels like a good one too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's how we starting the day off, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, sir. I believe Frankenslab had a hit too. But he'll come back. But how about a nice bluegill, ladies and gentlemen? That's how we starting the day off. I'm getting excited now. I'm finna get excited. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Nice bluegill. Woo! He going to the grease, ladies and gentlemen. We going back out there. We going back out there. I bear that wind. Look at that. I'm flying. Well, watch how these three eighths of an ounce help you out. They'll get you where you need to get. Another bite, ladies and gentlemen. Had another bite. Seems as though they don't mind the wind. He hit it and let it go. He'll be back. But y'all see what's going on, ladies and gentlemen. What I want you guys to do is stay tuned. I'm finna go ahead and finish baiting up holes and get them out there. And y'all just be ready for some bent over rods. Slap like baby. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I know I'm supposed to be out here filming, but I'm gonna keep it to myself, man. I just know that God is good, man. Okay? Before we even go any further, know that God is good. And I ain't talking about just because he gave me these. I have been getting a lot of phone calls this morning from car dealerships, ladies and gentlemen. I'm right now I'm car shopping. Okay, so I just got some good news this morning. Okay, so uh, that's the reason why I ain't been able to film. I've been on the phone, ladies and gentlemen, talking, talking, talking. But my rod's been steady bending over as I've been talking, ladies and gentlemen. As you guys can see, I caught a few bluegills and a very nice shell cracker. Y'all got to witness the one I caught as soon as I threw out there. But uh, we finna try to go to get the show on the road. I just wanted to go to let you guys know I apologize and let you guys know how good God is. Keep faith. Keep grace, keep him in your heart, pray, do all your part. He gonna do his part every time. It may not be when you want it, but it's always right on time. He's on time, God. Yes, he is. I love that song. But anyway, um, we finna go ahead and get back to filming, ladies and gentlemen. I apologize again. I gotta handle my business, ladies and gentlemen. I'm so sorry. But I got, I'm getting me a new vehicle, ladies and gentlemen. The dealership was calling me very, making sure that I could come up there and meet him today. And boy, I had to answer that phone call, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry. But hey, we finna get out here and get us some fish. Slide like, baby, let's do this. If I could get y'all propped up. How that look? Y'all can see me? Yeah. Okay, that was on top of them jabs. Quick, ladies and gentlemen. Bop, 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 bop. I ain't a fighter, I'm a fisherman. I can fight though, no. but hold on, y'all. Uh, let's get this pole out here. Cause this pole right here, that orange one right there, boy, she going off. And I just hooked some on new guy, 
And as you guys can see, they wasn't trying to come out the water. They popped it. So that got broke. We got a uh, we got a uh, Franken Franken slab right here. I couldn't even get her back out because I'm on the phone. And the wind out here is going crazy, ladies and gentlemen. I know y'all see that see the camera shaking. The wind is crazy this morning. I'm trying to show y'all how y'all can still catch some fish in the wind. Y'all had them three eighths of an ounce sinkers. You gonna do exactly that. But what I'm finna do right now is I'm finna bait up and cast back out. They biting pretty good this morning too, may I add. About to fly away, ladies and gentlemen, look at me. Ooh, I don't want y'all to fly away. Oh, oh, right on time, ladies and gentlemen. But y'all get the show today. Oh, here's what I go through, ladies and gentlemen. Trying to get content for y'all. But hey, I love it. I love it, ladies and gentlemen. I love it. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I love it. Is you gonna stay? Huh? Hold on, y'all. Y'all bear with me, fellas. I'm trying. Lord knows I'm trying for y'all. Okay, here we go. Ta-da! Here we go. I've been hitting them pretty good right here off this little corner tip. I had to throw back two. Everything else been coming out bucket ready. All right, now y'all watch that tip for me while I get this other pole painted up. Oh, freaking slam. But I hooked something big on new guy. It broke my line, ladies and gentlemen. Got wrapped up in something down there. You win some, you lose some. But you live, you live to fish another day. I just put old Franken slab right there where a new guy got bent over and got popped. I should put three out there, what y'all think? Nah, I got my hands full with two in this wind. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back to the water, okay? Remember earlier, I showed you guys, new guy got popped. So, I wanna show you guys how to rig a bottom rig, how I rig them for a bluegill and a sharecracker. Remember I was telling you guys I was on the phone with a dealership earlier, as you guys can see. Custom Slabs got him a new truck today. All oh, glory to God. We give it to God, everything. And yeah, this is my new truck right here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm drunk today. Nice. I'm drunk. Of she is Chevy Colorado and I am absolutely blessed and I am I feel great I mean I'm, I'm just happy excited ladies and gentlemen but we made it back to the water though now come on back here let me show you guys right now first you're gonna start off with line this is everything you're gonna need for a model rig ladies and gentlemen Need some line for the lead, hooks, swivels, weight of your choice. But you guys all know I use three eighths of an ounce. Now I see that three eighths of an ounce. Now this is how we start, ladies and gentlemen. You always want to start with your weight. Get your three eighths out of there. Put them back in your tackle box. Okay. Want to get your line? Put it right through those holes. Uh oh, y'all forgive, professor. Just like that, and you want to leave that free, okay? 
You don't want to tie that weight, just let it stay free. Then you want to go in this pack here and get you some swivels. Okay, for all my people that do not know what swivels are, that's a swivel. Okay, that's a swivel right there. It has two ends where you can tie two lines, okay? Now what you want to do is you want to put your line in one of those circles and do whatever knot you feel free of doing. I just do a regular uni knot, a single uni, not a double. Make sure it's nice and tight, bite off the excess, clip it off, whatever you guys do. Then you want to get your lead line, ladies and gentlemen. Right here, what I have is 15 pound lead. Sometimes I go with 12. This all depends on what you guys want to do. I go a little overkill sometimes because here in Florida, our shell cracker get very big and bluegill and they like to wrap you around things sometimes. And I like to have that extra little bit of muscle to be able to pull them out of those uh, hard places when they run me in. Seven, okay. Get your knot. Put your knot in now. <clears throat> just like that. Now you're just left with this line, okay? Long, okay. Put your swivels up now. You want to get you the hook. It's probably your most gentle even claw fan. I love even claw, ladies and gentlemen. These number tools right here they work well for me. You guys are free to use whatever hook size you guys like, okay? Okay, put your line in there and do whatever knot that floats your boat. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Bottom rig set up, okay? Now, the reason why you leave that weight free like that, the fish will never feel it. As you guys can see, it's free. So when it's down there on the bottom and the weight's there, the fish can literally just pull that line and they feel like they pull a free worm. They don't know nothing because the weight, they can't feel it. Bite off your access. Look at new guy. Ready to go. Need his worm. Uh-oh. Get cast out. And she's ready to go. Hopefully I taught you guys something. Hopefully I help you guys out on how to make some bottom ribs, ladies and gentlemen. Now let's go catch some fish. Slide like baby. Y'all stay tuned. We'll be right back with y'all. Got one on new guy, ladies and gentlemen. And as you guys can see my line everywhere, I just passed that pole out and he tried to take it. I had to grab it. So that pole thing. Oh my god, look at this shell cracker, ladies and gentlemen. On ice. He's back. Just lost the fish catch this morning. All right, ready to put up. Oh! I just lost the fish. Y'all stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. Slide life, baby. Just had a fight right here on you guys, ladies and gentlemen. Sitting there with it, he wouldn't pull it no more than that. Nice bluegill, though. Yeah, let it jump there. Chubby, chubby. We're gonna get this one on nice, ladies and gentlemen. You hear me? Okay, we're gonna sit it down and shut it. 
<laughs> Slide like baby, y'all stay tuned for some more rod bands. Look how they doing that worm, ladies and gentlemen. They ain't playing with it in the wind. They out here bending it over. You understand me? They are bending it over out here in the wind. And they eating that worm. As you guys can see, I had to go deep in there to get that worm. I'll let him go. He is eating size, but I'll let him go. I want him a little bigger. I was on the phone with the dealership earlier, ladies and gentlemen. My pole bent over while he was on the phone. I had to make him hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, when I tell you it was a big, big bluegill, I wish you guys could have seen Well, y'all got to see him in the cooler, but I wish you guys could have seen him come in. Boy, you talking about a big old, big old fat bluegill. Oh, yeah. And they're not hitting in the same areas as they were hitting last time. As you guys see, the orange pole ain't as active as it was. But new guy done found him a little something going on. I'm going to show you guys where I'm casting at. Back up a little bit, baby. I told y'all I'm a superstitious fisherman. Yeah, I want it right back in the same area. I already was out here crying. Y'all see my sheriff had to jump out the cooler as soon as I threw him in there, jump back in the water. like that Yeah, this that life for loving Cause you're dealing with some fishermen 